So I'm going to show you how to create scannable QR code so you can use them on your business cards or any document or for any purpose. Without further ado, let's jump straight into it. First thing first, you're going to open up your preferred browser and search for QR code monkey. So to create this QR code, you're going to open up this QR code monkey website. There will be a link in the description to this website. So all you have to do is to open up this website on your most preferred browser. So once you open up this website, you're going to see a lot of links where you can send people to. So you can send people, once they scan the QR code, you send them to a particular direction. So you have your URL, you have your text, email, phone, SMS, and so on. So let's say I want to send people to my YouTube channel once they scan my QR code. I'm going to click on YouTube and then paste my YouTube link here. And once I paste my YouTube link, I'm going to set color if you like. But I like using black, so I'm going to leave it at black just as what it is for the color. And then you're going to add custom image if you like to, but I don't like adding any image, so I'll just leave it just the way it is. You can customize your design anyhow you want your QR code to look like here, but I'm going to leave it just as default. All I'm going to do is to add my YouTube link. And once I do that, you see this code here. All you have to do is to increase the quality of the code, how you want it to be. Personally, I like leaving it at high quality. And then I'm going to click on create QR code. And once you click on create QR code, it brings up the preview of your code. So let's see if this code is scannable okay so if you are using a phone that can scan qr codes directly from the camera you can just launch your camera and scan the code but if your phone does not support that you're going to install google lens to your phone so on my phone i have my google lens which i'm going to click on my google lens app and it opens up so i'm going to use the google lens to scan this qr code let's see what it looks like so I'm going to position my camera on the frames of the code and it brings up this link. Once I do that, it brings up this link which I'm going to click. And once I click on the link, it takes us to this uh, YouTube channel which is my YouTube channel. And that is how it works. You can send people to any other direction, okay? You can send people to anywhere you want to send them to. Okay, let's try something else. If you want to send people to a particular website, maybe you have a personal website you want to send people to through your QR code. All you have to do is to click on your URL and paste the website here. So let's say we want to send people to dafont.com. I'm going to paste the link to dafont website. Once you click on URL, you paste the link to dafont website and click on create QR code. And let's see what it works. Okay, the QR code is out. And again, pick up your phone and make sure your phone is connected to the internet. Place the camera on the frames of the code and then scan it. Click on the link that appears on your phone screen and you can see it takes us to dafont.com website. And pretty much that is how it works. Okay, one last example I'm going to show to you. This one, I'm going to do it with my email. So this time around, I'm going to click on email and I'm going to add my email here. Ask Dennis Joshua at gmail.com. Okay, that's cool. Then click on create QR code. And again, the QR code pops up. Pick up your Google Lens app and scan it again. And once you scan that, it brings this up on the screen. Click on the code. And it searches for this result you click on email and it brings up this where you have to go to your gmail you click on just once and once you do that it takes people to send you a mail just like what you see here okay it's practically very very easy i'm going to leave a link to get the google lens app in the description or you can search it on play store or the link to this website will also be on the description so once you are done with that you click on download png 
and when you click on download png it starts to generate the code which is going to be on your download folder okay so once this is done downloading you go to your download folder and you will see your code just as what you see here on my download folder so pretty much this is how to generate qr codes you can use them for your business card or for any design purpose basically to send people to a particular direction where you want them to go to thank you so much for watching if you like to see more videos on tips and tricks like these ones let me know down in the comments and make sure you like and share this video with a friend click on this video and watch how i make flyers with photoshop thanks so much for watching and see you next time